React was made so that people had an easy button. The lowest common denominator of programmers at Facebook couldn't deal with the stuff that the person who created React at Facebook could deal with. So the person who created React at Facebook created React to help out the other developers who could not keep up with everything that this person was doing and the upcoming things that features and whatnot that they needed to, to implement in Facebook. Ultimately, when you reduce that down, it's just developers don't know how to do something, even though it's not about them being stupid, because I don't actually believe that. I think a lot of developers are actually quite smart, but we're not doing them any favors. We're not actually utilizing that. We're not encouraging them to use their brain. Instead, what we do is we go, they uh, uh, these programmers complain that they can't do something when really they just need a little bit of a helping hand to do something. Uh, so instead of helping them, what we do is we go, well, we'll create a tool for you and it's an easy button. That principle of you don't need to do thinking, someone else has done thinking for you and created a tool to reduce your, your requirement to think. That's in the form of, for example, right now, AI, which is a speed run version of that same principle. And AI is now being embedded into hardware. For example, your NVIDIA graphics cards, which are now going to generate frames between actual frames while you're playing video games so that the d programmers of a video game do less. There you go. That's why React has ruined the entire industry top to bottom. Top to bottom, it's all, it's all destroyed.